Okay, so uh, I was asked to do a review of this Trader Joe's uh, Indian meal. This is an authentic Indian recipe on the box. Uh, satisfying traditional Indian flavors. That may or may not be true, I don't know. Um, I've never been to India or anything, but... Uh, it is spendy for a... Uh, for a, in my mind, it's spendy for a, a, a frozen meal, microwave. Uh, I was taken aback when I uh, opened it up because you because the amount of lamb I got was literally two pieces of lamb, it basically drenched in sauce. The sauce was fine. The sauce is fine. I don't have a problem with the amount of sauce, but it basically drenched in sauce. The sauce was fine. The sauce is fine. I don't have a problem with the amount of sauce. I don't know if you can see that. I'm getting two pieces of lamb. Literally, period. Two pieces of lamb. And they're about uh, uh, three quarters of a centimeter by, uh, by about an inch. Each one. So, flavors are good. It's very spicy. I, I It's very spicy, actually. I'm having trouble eating it. Um, the heat level is high yeah. for me. I'm actually someone I feel like I can take a fair level of spice. It's it's a it's a pretty responsible meal. Um, it's a 360 calories total and okay. 130 from fat. Right. So it's you know fine. Yeah, basically drenched in sauce. The sauce was fine. The sauce is fine. I don't have a problem with the amount of sauce. It did weigh in at 26 grams of protein, which I found was seemed pleasantly hot. I would have guessed high too, but it's coming in at, at 610 milligrams, which is 25% of your daily. So that's not, you know, it's not going to break the bank as far as sodium. Again, not a lot of lamb going on, but I think the flavors are good. I'm seeing this as a, as a pretty clear pass. Yeah, you You've are. been pretty angry for the last hour about the lamb amount. How does the lamb taste? The, lamb, the lamb amount some. is shocking. How does it taste? Are you sort of holding on to them? I'm gonna break it apart. It breaks apart nicely. The lamb. Can I get a zoom on the interior of the lamb? I just want to see the cooking level. Is it basically like, like a stew level Slow of cooking? Roasted. It's brown, stew, it's brown all the way through? Yeah. There's the lamb chunk. There's one of them. There's one chunk, and then here's the other one. So okay. those are the only lamb portions that I was given. That's what I was upset about yeah. uh, throughout this whole thing. So uh, it, I, think it's, I think the underlying thing is an issue of qu uh, quantity. Um, I think the flavors are there. And spice, too prohibitively spicy. You know, it's funny because it's 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 almost like the spiciness is backing off as it cools or something. I don't know. I don't even know if that's possible. It doesn't even really make sense to me. I wouldn't serve this to anyone I cared about on any level. There are worse meals. The underlying thing I think overall is quantity. That's what I was upset about uh, throughout this whole thing. Again. Not a lot of lamb going on, but I think the flavors are good. There's the lamb chunk, there's one of them. There's one chunk, and then here's the other one. So, okay. those are the only lamb portions that I was given. That's what I was upset about uh, throughout this whole thing. What frozen entree currently on the market will you serve to end? That's a good question. It is. I would probably microwave the shit or bake the, sh bake the shit out of like a fish stick meal. Okay. I think overdoing things is, is, is a good way Underdoing is pretty rough too. If you for cold, but you can always sticks. put it back in. You Not if you're in charge of the mic microwave and the enemy is in your own home. Yeah. Which I think is what we're describing. Yeah.